Welcome back to WTVA 9 News at 6. I'm Craig Ford. Many people across Mississippi dealt with power outages or a loss of water because of last week's winter storms. Now, Mississippi's Public Service Commission will review utilities to make sure future weather events don't disrupt needed services. WTVA's Chelsea Brown spoke with Public Service Commissioner Brandon Presley about what they are looking for in the review. The three public service commissioners started Wednesday reviewing the infrastructure of utility departments around the state. Commissioner Presley said the commissioners are focused on electricity, gas, and water. The public has a right to know that the lights will be on when they need them, the heat will be there when they need it. Last week's winter storm impacted electricity and water in some areas. The three public service commissioners are looking at the state's utilities. Presley says they want to make sure people will not have to go without power or water if and when we could see another winter storm. Uh, Mississippi is prepared for tornadoes and hurricanes. We're used to those. Mm -hmm. But the cold weather events that we saw of the last week is not a norm. Brandon Presley wants to know the different utility departments' plans to winterize the equipment. Presley said he wants the data for things like tree trimming over power lines. He says many times limbs or trees fall, causing power disruptions. Presley said many utility departments had problems with equipment or water wells freezing up in the frigid temperatures, causing people not to have water, power, or heat. We have to work with our utility providers. Uh, we want to understand better uh, what efforts, what are the lessons they've learned. He said our state utility workers did great this past week in the storm, but does not want what happened in Texas with the lack of power and water to happen here. What efforts do we need to make today to make sure that this doesn't happen in the state of Mississippi? Presley said this review could take months to finish, but wants to make sure everything is looked at. In Hamilton, Chelsea Brown, WTVA 9 News.